Hello, this is Rick and welcome to another video from DxOMR. So we've been performing our tests and analysis and today we'd like to present some of our findings in camera and a bit more on the new Honor Magic 4 series of smartphones by highlighting some of the latest additions from the China-based Honor brand. So today we'll take a look at the Honor Magic 4 Ultimate, the Honor Magic 4 Pro, and finally the Honor Magic 4 Lite 5G. So let's see some of the highlights from our testing. So first up, the Honor Magic 4 Ultimate. So the Magic 4 Ultimate is Honor's current flagship device, available only in China for now. But we couldn't talk about the Magic 4 series without briefly mentioning it. The device performs so well in our testing that it currently sits as the top score in camera with an overall score of 146 and remains a high bar set by Honor for 2022 devices in general. The device also sits as the current top score in both of our photo and zoom subscores with subscores of 153 and 107 respectively and is one of the top 10 devices in our video subscore as well with a score of 117. So here's some samples of the Magic 4 Ultimate in both photo and video taken during our testing. So overall, from a user standpoint, we found that the device was excellent with nighttime photography, had a fast autofocus system, and was very good with shooting video with movement. To learn more, you can read our entire review of the Magic 4 Ultimate at dxomark.com. So though the Magic 4 Ultimate is only available in China for now, Honor's released another option for the rest of the world. And this brings us now to the Honor Magic 4 Pro. The Honor Magic 4 Pro scores a combined camera score of 131, with 138 in photo, 82 in zoom, and 109 in video. So the Magic 4 Pro retains many characteristics and specs of the Magic 4 Ultimate, though slightly pared down or in different configurations, as with the camera modules. So in photo, the device provides generally high quality images in both indoor and outdoor conditions, and an acceptable image quality for low light conditions. So in outdoor, we did notice a slight orange cast, however, as we can see here, compared to the Google Pixel 6 Pro, which though slightly warm, remains more neutral. Another comparison here shows how the Magic 4 Pro is able to retain more details in the background thanks to a higher dynamic range. We can also see that the Magic 4 Pro also provides vivid and pleasant color rendering. In low light, we did find some visible chroma noise in some scenarios. So here we can see how the chroma noise in the curtains affects not only the texture of the pattern, but the color as well. In bokeh testing, the resulting effect is pleasant, but we did notice a strong motion artifact instability in this scene. So in night, the Magic 4 Pro showed great color in most tested scenes, both with and without flash, though we did also notice some focus instabilities throughout our night analysis. So in wide, the Magic 4 Pro performed well, even better than the Magic 4 Ultimate in some cases, resulting in an acceptable level of detail, thanks to a good combination of hardware design and software capabilities. But it is important, however, to note that sometimes this can result in additional artifacts, as we can see here with the strong flare in the scene. In video, the device scored well, though we did find that there were some improvements that could be made in the area by Honor with the Magic 4 Pro. So let's take a quick look at part of an outdoor video scene we captured during our testing for use as part of our analysis. So we can see immediately in the video that an orange or pink color cast is present as seen in the upper area of the frame. Moving on, the technician walks forward with the device. And though the target exposure is good, we can still see some clipping that occurs on the white buildings in the background, resulting in some loss of detail. And as we approach the buildings later in the clip, the device will compensate and adjust to avoid the clipping. We can also take a look at the stability in this case and see that here the stability is good during the walking motion. Now once the technician begins to jog, the device does show some residual motion, but keeps the image fairly stable considering the vibrations and the shaking. And lastly, as we can see, there is some flare artifact to consider at the conclusion of the clip. So for all smartphones tested in camera, we will analyze hours of footage in total, checking for many other criteria. So let's look at some of the other video captured during our testing of the Magic 4 Pro for a variety of conditions. So overall, a strong showing from Honor and camera with the Magic 4 Pro. 
Let's dive a bit into another recent showing from Honor with their budget phone, the Magic 4 Lite. The Honor Magic 4 Lite scores a 95 combined in camera with subscores of 102 in camera, 35 in zoom, and 86 in video. So the Magic 4 Lite is Honor's budget version of the Magic 4 Pro with a lower spec set and less features than the more expensive Pro model. Unfortunately, to be expected from a budget device, image quality is usually not as good as with the Pro or Ultimate versions as we can see here. But perhaps camera's not a priority for you, which is why we can let you know that we also tested a device in our battery protocol and the results are looking quite good. The Honor Magic 4 Lite scores an 88 in battery. So what does that mean? Well, because of its great autonomy and charging scores, this is a great device for those who need a phone that will last in between charges or in case you forget to plug in your phone. So despite not being as powerful in terms of camera compared to the Magic 4 Ultimate and the Pro Editions, the light makes up for it by being a great device for those with battery in mind. So to boost charging on the Magic 4 Lite, you can earn more than nine hours of autonomy in five minutes of charging. In fact, we've tested the battery and power consumption data of many different smartphone devices under our battery protocol. So don't forget to check out the battery rankings on our website if this is perhaps an important thing you're looking for in your mobile device. So let's recap some of those scores for the Honor Magic 4 devices that we spoke about today. So if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell to be notified of future videos, and stay with us because we got more videos on the way. So once again, this is Rick. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video.